I think the most important thing that I've realized uh, over the years is that people, a lot of people fear me. Once you realize that your opponent is not like mentally prepared to play for a win, then you can take a lot more chances. It's good to uh, to get some some young players here. Try and I try and inspire them. Uh, we have good trainers, of course, here who try to teach them properly as well. The main reason why I came here because I wanted to know how he thinks. Because in my opinion, he's a genius. He relies more on his inter intuitive uh, thinking and less on his calculation, which is uh, very interesting for me because I'm like the other way around. Yeah, it's just very interesting to be here and see like how he prepares uh, for like the world championship and his psycho his psychology in, in general. I really like had to force myself to say that you have to you have to continue. You have to like you're not better by any means, but you have to continue to play. I've won so many games that way over the years. Do you feel yourself that this is the end of an era? No, I mean uh, I I don't think sort of the era is, is over quite yet. No. He has already won so much that I don't think he has so much motivation now to win World Championship again. It's of course sad, I think, for the chess world that's, that he gives away the, the World Championship title because it's it's clear to everyone that he's uh, he's clearly the best player and he has been so for the last 10 years. I kind of understand because uh, I mean, I've been fed up with uh, you know, preparing for matches. There have been many Many times, even later in my career, where I was thinking, like, uh, where I've suffered a bad loss, and I'm thinking, like, yeah, maybe I just lost it. Maybe I don't have it anymore. Who do you think will be the next world champion? <laughs> Who do you <laughs> hope will be the next champion? I don't care. <laughs> I haven't got any plans right now to follow the World Championship, whether, I mean, I, I will probably follow, but I don't think I'll go out of my way to watch the games live, but I'll, I, I mean, I will check out the games for sure. Peter Heino also in his talk, he uh, showed us how much work it is, how many months in advance you have to prepare for a match, so yeah, I can understand it, but I hope to be back, that he will be back. I've said several times that I'm not completely ruling out coming back to the World Championship, um, especially under a different format, but uh, as a fan I wouldn't hold my breath.